Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. I am Squishy the Titan, and welcome to Craven Manor. Now, this is a game that is not new by any means. It uh, was released a while ago uh, without like any sort of client, but um, I saw it was on Steam Greenlight, and I decided that I was going to wait until that release, uh, just because I feel like Steam Greenlight games tend to be quite a bit more refined and updated. Um, than, you know, clientless games. So I know this may be oversaturated a little bit, but I haven't played it and I don't- I haven't seen any Let's Plays of it, so I'm gonna play it now. Let's get into it. Um, actually first, uh... Okay, there you go. The mouse sensitivity- I did a, um, fraps test with this. And the mouse sensitivity is ridiculously high, so I may actually have to switch the DPI down on my mouse. Like, I, I put it all the way down, and I was still, like, whipping around whenever I looked. <clears throat> also, um... <clears throat> I know that my hair looks especially brown today. I, for the first time in a while, had to actually turn on the lights to get decent lighting because, uh, it is pretty dark and stormy outside. So that's just great. Yeah, I'm gonna have to flop that down. Had to go full three settings down. I usually, if anybody, for anybody who knows what this means, I usually play with, uh, the DPI at 4500, that's a comfortable speed for me. Uh, which, as many of you will know, is friggin' fast as hell. But, uh, I had to switch this down to 800 to be manageable. Alright, token. It's got the KM on it, I'm guessing for Craven Manor. Okay. Can't do anything with that quite yet. Is there anything? Hello. Notes of William Craven. Initially, I lamented that the rituals of October were failures. However, months later, I turned my back... What? I turned my back to a statue I thought hollow and dead, and the spirit within made itself known. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, we've got a mannequin, ladies and gentlemen. We've got a goddamn mannequin. Eerie bronze statue stands atop the pedestal. I don't like you. I don't like you already. Okay, I don't like you. 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 Turn back. I don't like you. I already do not fucking like this game. Oh, we're being ushered into a place. Okay. It's fantastic. You looking at me again? Yeah. Yeah, you are. Oh, that's just lovely. For whosoever do not in, tr in the truth boasting of phantasms brag that they can do miracles, be destined to the torments of eternal fire. I don't really understand what that means, but I'm guessing that... It's basically, if you play Jesus, you will die. In hell. You will go to hell and you will die. Rejecting, rejecting the music of the spheres as the movements of astronomical bodies are incapable of generating sound. So basically, mumbo jumbo people worship the planets and said that they made music. No. The heat does not reach far into this cold room and is less than comforting. The house is supposed to be abandoned, yet something started the fire. Don't... Please, don't you mean someone started the fire? What's this? That's a nothing. Okay. I guess we're moving on. There was another pathway over here. I'm sorry if I'm biting my lip a lot, but, um... Mannequins are the single scariest thing to me in a, in a horror game. 
That's like the thing that I'm the least comfortable with. And I am already terrified because they just told me straight out, there's a mannequin. Establishing a clear boundary between true sorcery and the mere illusions of mentally ill women. What? Oh, they're talking about witches. Wine cellar model! Pick that up. Okay. I found a scale model of a wine cellar. It matches the model I saw in the entryway. Oh, cool. See, this game is doing it really right. They've got the atmosphere, they've shown you who the villain is, and I'm assuming he's gonna be a threat. Either that or he's just creepy. And... When they present you with a puzzle, they present you with directions on how to achieve the puzzle. You still there? You're still there! <laughs> oh, he's not there! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I found it. I found it. Hello? What a... Wine cellar model. Rotate room. Okay. Do I have a key? Can I take this key? Okay. E to exit. Statue piece. <gasps> Okay, so he's out and about. That's great. That's- oh! Whoa. There was a library here! Is that- is that what the pieces do? Do the- Fuck you! Oh, that's me, walking on the glass. Okay, so that's what the pieces do. They rearrange the building. Ah, oh, that's nifty. That's nifty. But I don't want to go down in the wine cellar. I don't. No. My brain is saying, oh no, that doesn't seem like fun. Please don't. Oh, Kyle, please don't. Notice. A notice to all Craven Metalworks employees. Thieves and layabouts shall be disciplined by Lord Craven and shall receive no wages during recuperation. Okay. Oh, what a- Fuck off! Upon close inspection, something seems to have torn into this painting with dozens of thin, fine scratches. Like bronze? Oh god, I really- I honestly, I already don't want to play this. But I'm gonna play it! Cause it started. This photo is labeled 1857 Craven Metalworks and depicts a grim, well-dressed man in his 40s at the grand opening of a factory. I keep- I- I hate- fucking hate turning around because I know something is gonna be there. Eventually. Blueprint. The blueprint design is attributed to William Craven. The architecture reflects both scrupulous detail and extremely strange structural components. I don't like turning around. Within these construction, expense reports are references to hidden passageways and moving walls. Okay. Alright, just keep it moving. I saw it! I saw you! You fuck. You fucking fuck. I I must my mouse button to throw. Okay. Blood. Blood. That's That's blood. Okay. Oh. <sighs> 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 Where's that bottle? Where's the bottle? Bottle, 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 bottle. Bottle. Fuck you! Okay. Alright. Stop being a baby. 
Get out. I will get out. I promise you I will get out. I, I, I will, I will, I will, I, you are not letting me get out. Okay, is then... God damn it. <gasps> ah! <laughs> fuck you! <sighs> what the fuck was that? What the fuck? It was crawling! Ugh. Okay. This game... This game doesn't like me. Bedroom model. Okay. Okay. Okay! Running, 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 running! Well, that's a namby-pamby run! Okay. Okay. I'm gonna be right back, guys. Seriously, right back. This game is giving me, like... I don't know why, this is scaring me most- more than almost any other game that I've ever played. Like, this is really scary, it's so good. I will be right back and continue with this. Okay, I'm back. And we've gotten the bedroom model now. Whether that's upstairs or down here, I don't know. I I'm guessing it's upstairs. Stop with the flickering lights. S fucking stop with the flickering lights. I don't- I was saying this is- this is so perfect of a horror game because you've got the isolation, you've got the villain, it's shown that it's a threat, it is going to be pursuing you, so you've got the panic section where you're just sitting there like, just eat, like, keeping your head on a swivel, like trying not to get snuck up on, and it's provided you with a clear objective, and it's just- it's scary. It really is scary. And it does shit like that! It does shit like that! Okay. You stay in there, buddy! Okay! <laughs> is it that? Oh, inside this book are many diagrams and sketches of human teeth. Okay. Balls. Balls. Ballsenheimer. Alright, actually, I am going to... I'm sorry to have to end the video really... Really early. I know this is, like, only 13 minutes long. But, like... Uh... As most of you know, I do this before work. And it's actually, I'm running out of time before work, and it did just save. I don't know how long it's gonna be until the next save. And, yeah, I can't save from the menu. But, uh, I will leave all of this... Ornate key. Let's take that. I will save this, uh, for... Tomorrow. Or I will save the rest of this for tomorrow. I think it's a short game. It's only supposed to be, like, about a half an hour to 45 minutes long, so I will play the rest of this tomorrow. Um... But, thank you all so much for watching. As always, like... Comment, subscribe, and tell your friends about me. I am Squishy the Titan, and I will see you in part two of Craven Manor. Bye, guys!